What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Jung Web Soul. My name is Panya. I'm here to enlarge your frequency, to alter your consciousness, to higher your mind, to transcend above the deprivation, to ascend to the celestial from here on earth. And why don't want to spend your hair now, not delaying time? I have been asked a lot about fruitarian. They ask, what is fruitarian? They ask me if I'm fruitarian because there's a lot of misconceptions on that topic that we became that peaceful warrior, the fruitarian or vegetarian. The fruit to me is food, henceforth fruitarian. The fruitarian style of the peaceful warrior spirits is avoiding meat, all kind of meats or animals, bone, flesh, and skin. However, eggs is exceptionals. They just exclude the cruelty. Animals, products of kindness, eggs, why not? You know, such as eggs and dairies has no harmful or negative effect. It has been since time, since time immemorial. But we have to think things through thoroughly. Use your own discernment with sensitivity and heart. Because you desire to grasp more fundamental understanding of what is right, what is wrong. The forces, the life force, the the forces of the beings that which you want to consume it. Each living organism from the macrocosm and the microcosm. So consume eggs, sure, if you want to. To each their own. I currently just refeed myself with eggs. Of course, been having fruits, nuts, and vegetables. As for the terrans, that's not necessarily consuming food only because there's restrictions you know uh, fasting of course that's something that has been done since time immemorial so the actuality of the food is deeply rooted ingrained within the clear vision of individuality understanding that they are in fact gross in a subtle way that's when through meditation and through a clarity of view on once we perceive it and have to have the essence of the nature herself so vegetarians or vegans fruitarians pescetarians all that is uh, pretty much in the process of becoming a better version of yourself for longevity <laughs> it may be a long way it's a curvature of the view of life and journey through this avenue patterns the recognitions the adventure you know that we uh foregone for saw and very logical in linear fashion is the algorithm have a wonderful many blessings and some well-beings so when we um, recalibrate and change the way we consume things we can consume literally consume and also consume what we see visually as well too we would have the self-love when we have that self-discovery and self-actualizations and you know the realization indeed is the life experience as a life coach and higher consciousness that we ascend with awareness decoding the complexity within our ordinary to become more extraordinary mind or my heart spirits baby so within the peaceful warriors that we consume and uh strict, strictly speaking of the honey that most may not want because they're vegan honey there's no harm done i mean there's a lot of stuff going on as well too but do your research and um you know, harm anybody, it's all good. So real note is that I appreciate honey, bee, I appreciate eggs, I appreciate cherry, uh, cherry, <laughs> cherry as well too, um, cheese, you know, the, the honeymoon, honeycomb, honey you are sweet and scrum scrumptious because the, the honeybees, the cheese melt in your mouth. You know, I, I love pizza with a uh, pineapple <laughs> and more cheese as well too. That's mean the diet exclude of animals you know pineapple and fish vegetables so eggs and dairy honey you know I, I love it honey and no harm done to both you and i or animals in that matters so as we sink deeper into uh, our subconscious mind and to dig deeper within ourselves and our nature and our beehive behave and knowing that it's all good so i like to leave the statement that with moderation however process the way of the traditional we you know, milk a cow, for example, back then, and now there's more. I mean, there's, there's a lot of stuff going on as well, too. So, uh, there's almond milk now. So, there's a lot of stuff that has been changed. And cheese that I recently got it was it's vegetarian cheese. It's not made from um, cow. So, it's going to give that a try. Okay, so consuming it so it's less cruelty by any means. So, there's alternative cheese that I, I just mentioned now that is focused upon the the macro precise, precise manner of, uh, you know, <laughs> The, the calibrating is alternative cheese, meaning it's from plant based. So, whom, whom are beloved pizza? I mean, what pizza that will make cheese alternative? Not quite just yet. So, you gotta do it yourself. And well, with compassion and with all those utmost respect and being a vegetarian and vegetarian as a human beings, you know, without slaughtering holy cow for the meat or milk the cheese. And then get the slaughter. I mean, I, you know, I've seen it, watched it, researched it, looked into it too. You know, with the careful consideration and science engineering, the cheese from nuts and plants, base, it's, it's out there now. So uh, go help yourself out and uh, give that a try. 
with all due respect because I like pineapple, spicy red pepper, onion, cheesy pizza, right? And if you're out of weeks or months or so, you know, it just give that, you know, about 20 to 30 percent of the acid food that we consume, you know, with chips sometimes and 80 percent of alkaline food, which have, you know, fruits, nuts, and vegetables, and beans, and rice tortilla, uh, not wheat bread, you know, black day bread, or that super bread from Trader Joe's or whatever your favorite um, market is. So this implication is that as long as no animal spirits or the lifetron of the life force of the life beings, the life spirits, in other words, by all means consuming is concluding, you know, as the fruitarians, it's the veganism in the process of becoming from pescatarians, a flexitarian, whoever you are that where you are in a state of life. Don't beat yourself up. I mean, there's no harm done. Just uh, be able to uh, uni by unions, unisons with your dark side and your, your lights with peace of mind and love of heart and the high vibration and sustain of your life, the force that we are living in. You know, um, it's not always that easy. It's not always that easy when we have the holistic approach and uh, within the free spirit sovereignty, both animals and human alike to the small micro to the highest, and not the highest, the largest of macro, we waste a lot of food in this United States, right? We grow food in a farm that the farmer sometimes have cannot sell it, so it get disposed or in the market on uh, factories. I mean, there's a lot of food that's just in the process and just transported or now they have what is called the um, imperfection food. I mean, they're still making money. I mean, all the stuff is all about retail, whatnot. So whatever goes unsold, it get wasted, right? So there's, I don't know too much the more i learn <laughs> sometimes these things that we call food is actually the remain of the sentient beings um cognitively agile animals that who wanted to live you know because in life as i watched and view and learn about the african safari uh, animals devour one another it kill or to be killed in any ways that serve our food their food you know most vegan vegetarian vegetarian would agree that no animal should have suffer for the for us to eat you know, they don't like they shouldn't have to die for a semen to eat. That's why there's alternative and that's why there's options. That's why there are grocery stores, you know, there's there are so many options. It's like heaven on earth. So with that understanding of the mining, the infliction of lifelong pain and mis misery and uh finally death of the animals just for food for the human beings. So, you know, you, you just gotta speak for those who are unable to speak for themselves. So as this following up through the advocating of the food vegetarian, vegetarian and a vegan we have been known and have the knowledge of how things are as we lay these foundations and you know giving the details in depth as much as we can and research is it means to be a vegetarian what does it mean to be vegetarians to have compassion and empathy and to have your understanding understanding <laughs> altruism food vegetarians you gotta have that fundamental understanding. You have to do your research towards all sentient beings. That's having compassion and love and kindness. You know, the bars, pubs, restaurants, in public cities, demographic, you know, show that the percentage of the edible way of animals products that enter the retail market are as food are eaten and then sometimes just thrown away as a landfill. You know, that's sad, sad truth. And there are two kinds of losses that depict in this in this life that we see, we view, we learn, we read, we we lost this a lot of uh, the level of our beings because the riches and riches don't have, to have the responsibility to become ignorance as well too without learning because they don't know where the overstock of food of inventory came from. They think that's like fruits. They think it's from the market only. They don't know it's from the, <laughs> the nature and they don't know that meat Cow, for example, cow is meat, right? The rotisserie chickens is from animals. And it's sell it dozen by the day. Losses to the consumer. The level of those carnivore that consuming just because there's parting, there's meeting, there's a, you know, just when they're gathering, it's a lot of spoiler. This is a spoiler, yes. The expiration that date back in since time immemorial, you know, the buffet that we go consume or at home partying, as I mentioned, gathering, get together. The difference between strict vegetarian and vegan is that vegan is more like a trend. So do your research, you can only sermon. Vegetarian is my opinion is one of the best, including vegetarians, of course. Would you certainly agree to this? 
to, to a certain degree, the fractal, the geometric of microcosm and the macrocosm in this cosmos, in this universe, love is that, is that you have that empathy to love and kindness towards all sentient beings. That's including animals and most important, including yourself, compassion, right? So that's the ability to restrain ourselves as human, humanity at large, as a possibility that is positivity refrain from taking lives from thrill it's not a human conscious because i've seen like on posts on instagram you know it's killing a deer shooting deer you got shot i mean that's just it's a sport or whatever it is and boom wow right on yeah shot me come on this that's another oh my goodness <sighs> that's an example of that fat fact fat fact that killing is like, like a sport and they represent themselves as something cool or whatnot because they they hunt an animal or hunt a deer they hunt uh, whatever it is you know they, they got it down they got a shot down a buffalo whatever it is man you know it's just it's a practice that is need to be eliminated because it's it's not cool come on you kill another animal just for sports for fun just for your own thrill come on chill chill see that on your plate or what do you do uh, the service of just of just I need to relax for a second all right so throughout the cycle of earth the horizon over the sun parallel vertically that bring forth the ego Garuda the peaceful warrior spirits with the gratitude for all that we have learned the technology progressions disciplines for the mind to sustain the body not necessarily it has to be food consumption I mean for we were born as a custom tradition that we did but that's not longer us. It's a millions thing. We are no primitive. We are no longer that. We ease ourselves. We recalibrate ourselves. And as a lightsaber in Star Wars, <laughs> we love to understand it and get familiarized with what it is with our existence. The majestic sun of the ray shine illuminated love to produce the magnitude of discipline, our beauty, the plant based proficiency, and rooted that we are saturated when its soil has been with love and energy that we put in likewise it's for us and also likewise the plant is also we grow it as well too we flow freely welcoming sensitivity endlessly orientations of the spirits of light shine exponentially we expose to nature beauty origin and the orchestrate the ceaselessly of the oneness in all that matters all life matters black life matters everything matters stop agent hate <laughs> wonderful in the expression when we explore this extraordinary tremendously of the heart from the west seattle here and in west side baby love i am love you are and i'm free to turn love you you and i know we are formless seemingly this is desire of the spirits that materialize in this oneness of togetherness of ego and eco family the peaceful warrior conquer oneself is proliferation of love in love with love because i'm free to turn love you with peace of mind and love of heart Thank you for viewing, like, subscribe, and take yourself higher, elevate your mind, heighten that mind, and take this for considerations and make that shift and change within yourself, for yourself, and for your family, friends, and the world at large. Hey, you came to the world, you know how it is. You want to make a change, be the change you want to see in the world. Start with you.